Hi Falcons, I have my background complete. Over here in the layer window, I'm going to start turning on and off the various copies of balloons and gifts that I have surrounding the whole background. There's the band, but I even have some more presents right there, you know, kind of covering the legs and making everything look nice. The very last thing I want to do is put together a birthday message over here on the toolbar. I have my type tool selected. Now we're used to picking colors here, but when you select the type tool, your color tool is up here. And I encourage you to start with a message. Usually when you start off, you'll have something like Times New Roman here in your font. I'm going to put in um, have the best birthday ever, comma, Michelle, because of course that's my name. And as you can see, it's gone off the screen. So here in the layer window, I'm going to double click the T. That's automatically going to get the entire selection of type. And I'm going to use my size control to shrink it down. I can move it. I can change the font. And the font is an alphabet style. And as you can see, as I move it, it shows me my message in different styles. I'm going to go with this one. And I can pick a color. Be very careful about picking a color that you like versus a color that can be seen. Lots of people love this dark blue color, but it's very difficult to see, especially on black. And there's a reason we chose black for the background. So I want you to make sure that you're selecting a color that's easy to see. I'm going with orange. This is a complete image that is ready to get turned in. So let's save it, file, save as. You should have probably already saved this. I've already saved this once before. So I didn't necessarily need to use save as. I could have just come to save, put my new changes on the old file. It's ready to submit.